What's up everybody? This is Barbell and welcome back to some more Skyrim action. Thank you very much for joining me today and believe it or not, yes, I still do Skyrim videos. It might be five years in between uploads, but I'm not giving up yet, damn it. So I'm sure some of you watched my recent channel update video that I uploaded about two weeks ago and you're probably thinking, well, that's all well and good that he's returned, but why isn't he uploading anything? All I did was release a Doom video that was in my little upload box since like October of last year. And my explanation is I was trying to do a bulk recording session, get a bunch of different recordings done so I could start releasing them and not get behind schedule. So that's re the reason behind that. But yeah, it's been quite a while since I've done a Skyrim video. The last one was the robbery of Golden Glow Estate, which I have to say went precisely as I planned. It, nothing went wrong whatsoever, and I don't think any of the mercenaries there even knew that I robbed the place. Okay, spoiler alert, everything went to complete shit. But what else is new in my Let's Play? Everything goes wrong. That's just what happens in Barbell's Let's Plays. Anywho, what we're going to do today is just resume where we left off, and that means to continue the quest Dampened Spirits which means we need to travel to Hunting Brew Meadery and tell him we are the exterminator for the rat problem he has. I don't know why uh, my outfit wouldn't give me away. I'm pretty sure it'd be a little weird to see the Archmage himself, the Grand Archmage's Pimpus, say that he's the exterminator, but whatever. So if he's too dumb to realize that something fishy is probably going on, then not my problem. That sounds like a him problem, not a my problem. Ooh, we got little Khajiit merchants hanging out here. What time is it even? 4.30 in the morning. Oh! That is extremely creepy! Could you imagine just walking down the road, turning around, and there's this black horse with these deep red eyes, blood red eyes, just staring at you? The only thing that would make it even spookier is if there was a bunch of fog that rolled in, and you could just barely see him through the mist. Oh, God. So, Hunting Brew should be just dead ahead. Oop, nope, there, gotta do a little turn. Gotta swerve a little bit down on the path. I could've just fast traveled there, but I just felt like walking. Because it gives me a chance to talk with you guys a little bit more. Hope you guys have been doing well. And before this video is uploaded, I believe I should've uploaded Doom Part 11. And if I decided not to upload that, or should I say release it yet, that will be the next video that I release. And speaking of Doom, guys, I know I've mentioned this before, and I hate to constantly pimp out my stuff, but if you haven't checked out my other game series yet, if you've stuck purely to Skyrim, I highly encourage you to check them out, especially the new Doom game. Well, I guess relatively new, the 2016 Doom that I've been playing. Check it out, because things get absolutely nuts in that game. <laughs> and uh, plenty of fun moments to be had. So please, feel free to check it out. Of course you don't have to, it's just a suggestion by me. But I really enjoy that game. I mentioned several times in that Let's Play that it is quickly becoming one of my favorite games of all time. It is potentially rivaling Half-Life, which is my number one favorite game of all time. So, yeah, feel free to check it out. Lots of fun to be had. Alright, so apparently this dude is just standing... Ugh. You want to clean up that dead skeever? Not good for business. Well, I guess nobody's showing up at 5 in the morning except me! The Grand Archmagus Exterminatus? I don't know. Hello, Sabjorn. What are you gawking at? The Can't dead fucking rat on your here? floor? I don't know. <laughs> Can you blame me for looking that? Or looking at that? It's freaking disgusting, man. Clean that junk up. Get a giant broom and just sweep it under the rug. The rug you're standing on. That'll work. Is something wrong? Are you kidding me? Look at this place. I'm supposed to be holding a tasting of the new hunting brew reserve for the captain of the guard. If he sees the meadery in this state, I'll be ruined. I might be able to help you. Oh, really? And I don't suppose you'd just do it out of the kindness of your heart, would you? I'll do it I out of the kindness of your coin! Until the job's done. You'd better or I yell, SKEEVER! <laughs> um, uh, let's do, that's the only way I operate. Oh, very well. Here's half. You'll get the rest when the job's done. Five hundred million gold! Vermin are permanently eliminated before my reputation is completely destroyed. 
How do I permanently clear the vermin? I bought some poison. Oh, I was word? going to have my lazy good-for-nothing assistant Malice handle it, but he seems to have vanished. If you plan to the skeevers got him. Nest, it should stop them from ever coming back. You've got a deal. Don't come back until every one of those things are dead. I said 500 million coin, not just 500. Uh, whatever. You mentioned someone named Malice? Malice is the best deal I've ever made. Lent him a bit of gold some time ago. I knew he'd never be able to pay back. Nothing like free labor to make operating costs cheaper. Is it the best deal you ever made? Because according to you, five seconds ago, he just fucked off and you have no idea where he is. So I'm not sure no, if your free labor me. is really laboring at all. Sliced Idar cheese or Adar cheese? That's the cheese I keep calling moldy, but somebody called me out on it and they're like, stop calling that cheese moldy and disgusting. It's an actual type of cheese and it's delicious apparently. Well, I will never be caught dead eating that, okay? It looks gross. And moldy. All right, so let's head on to, oh. Bear traps. Isn't there like a, um, a thing that you can scribble in as part of one of the Thieves Guild little radio quests? I think it's up here. It's somewhere around here. I swear I'm not crazy. I swear. I swear I'm not crazy, guys. <laughs> Never mind the voices I keep hearing. <laughs> uh, where is it? There's a ledger, I think. I think that's what it's called. Letter to Sabjorn? Let's read. Sabjorn, this is my third and final offer. I feel that I've been more than generous with the amounts I've stated to buy your meadery. There's no reason for competition to stifle both of our businesses. Unified, we can make Blackbriar Mead a household name and bury anyone else who tries to start a similar business in Skyrim. If you wish to accept my offer, please come to Riften and stay at my manor as a guest. I think you'll find that being a part of the Blackbriar family would be both lucrative and life-saving. Are you threatening me, Master Jedi? The Senate will decide your fate. I am the Senate! I, I don't know what I'm doing exactly. I don't know why I'm up here. I don't even know why I want to find the ledger. It's not like I can do anything with it right now, I don't think. I guess at this point, it's just to prove that I'm not crazy. Oh yeah, lockpicking by the way. This is my strong point in this what's play. Did you know that? Good. Ooh. I completely forgot about these little things you can steal. <laughs> Even though I'm doing these guild quests, I completely forgot about stealing shit. You know, typical barbell action. I guess I'll take it. I think it's something you can sell or it like shows up on... There's like a shelf back in the Ratway. Or not the Ratway, but... What the hell's the Thieves Guild headquarters called? I forget. The Salty Spittoon? Yeah, that's it. And it kind of shows up. Just a little collectible thing. But I'm, I'm sure I already missed a bunch. Or maybe not a bunch, but whatever was in Golden Glow, I'm sure I missed. I think it's like a butterfly in a jar or something. Not 100%. Oh, jeez. Come on. Do it. Do it! Fuck! Damn you lockpicking. But Barbell, all you have to do is concentrate and you can easily pick that lock. No! Shut up, though! It's the game's fault, not mine. There we go. Good. Eight gold, really? That's kind of trolltastic, not gonna lie. Dude locks eight measly coin inside of an expert level strong box. What else we got? What's this? Nothing. <laughs> oh, what? this dude stored Blackbriar meat under his own bed. <laughs> I guess he's kind of admitting that his stuff sucks. Take a look at my fine boots. What's kind of funny is that's the one line I remember more than anything from Elder Scrolls 4 Oblivion is take a look at my fine wares whenever you try and buy something. The lusty Argonian maid. Oh my, I still need to read those books. I still need to make a Hearthfire episode. Man, you want to talk about not making a video in a long time? It's been millennia 
since I made a Hearthfire episode. But maybe I'll do that. Are you guys interested in possibly seeing that series resume? I don't know. Feel free to leave a comment down below with your thoughts on that. Hey, I totally didn't steal your gold or anything. Just uh, moseying around here looking for rats. Oh, I found one, and its name is Sabjorn. Oh, whoops! What's didn't mean to insult you there. Alright, let's get in there. Enough of the jibba jabba. Requires key. Don't mind if I do. Click. And... Watch, as soon as I power up, I'm just gonna get freaking mauled by a pack of rats. Oh. Venom Fang Skeever. Oof. Get first. Oh, I'm kicking my own ass for bear traps. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Lot of power auras down there. Also, let me check the freaking audio, man. Holy max audio. Let me turn that shit down. God damn. No, my luck, because I had it on max volume, it's distorting my freaking game audio in the... in the editing software. Guess what? Don't matter now. I already started recording, so I can't go back. I ain't redoing this shit like I used to do. Uh... Something is up with that barrel. The barrel's trying to disguise itself, but it's already in a barrel costume, so... I don't know what it's trying to accomplish there. Skeevas. I think I got fireball, right? Yes. Good. Good. Oh, wait a minute. Um, I can do some of this action. Check this out. You ready? You checking? Oh, my eardrums! They're gone! My eardrums have exploded. They are no more. So if you guys try and say anything, I won't hear you. Alright. Well, if you guys don't know, I used Animal Allegiance, but I didn't realize that these other skeevers were this far away. Also, those aren't even skeevers. I think they're spiders! So my attempt to create some friends was absolutely pointless. Oh. 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 <laughs> Constant barrage. Also, is this on legendary? It better be. Good, good. I'm just not used to killing things. Even though this is, what, episode 52 of the Let's Play? I'm still not used to killing stuff. All right, well, I guess all you can get roasted. I feel kind of bad doing that when they're still allied to me. But, you know, got to get that coin. Also, if any of you are wondering why this completely non-sneaky mage is doing some Thieves Guild action. It's because I want to get the final word of the disarm shout, which is quest locked in the Thieves Guild quest line. More specifically at Silver Drift Lair, I believe. I think it's Silver Drift. Um, it's whatever dungeon you go to to meet Carlia. And Mercer Frey backstabs you like the bitch he is. What? 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 What is this place? Isn't there a crazy rat king down here? Also, that was rude. So I'm gonna open you back up again. It's a trap! What kind of trap? What? What's the trap? I am really confused. Oh. I don't know about you guys, but I've never been killed by one of these traps before. I know in Oblivion, they fucking Shrek you so hard. It doesn't even look like they should. They just kind of slowly move into you. And then you get hit and your body just ragdolls, but it like slow motion and floats up and it gently floats down. But in this game, I've never been killed by that. It does no damage. Now the swinging log traps, those get up in your grill space and they knock your head clean off. But those swinging mace traps, I've never had a problem with that. But if any of you have, feel free to leave a little comment. Because I want to know. Hello. Get zapped. Get zapped. 
And that's Fever went flying. Oh, we got a fellow mage, eh? Oh, I can't cast while I'm using Breath Ward. Get the b -b 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 blast dude. I feel like going all out on this dude. Oh! Oh! Ah! Oh my god, I got owned! That's embarrassing! <laughs> Come the fuck on, damn it! He did massive damage. I didn't know he did damage. Why did you guys tell me he did fucking damage? Uh. Holy skeever damage! Heal! Oh, the poison! Wait a minute, you can just get paralyzed for a second. What is going on? Did I seriously get destroyed by some crazy rat king hermit dude in the depths of a metery? Did that happen, and, or am I just having a nightmare right now? I'm not 100% sure, because it is pretty damn spooky. Oh! All right. You done incurred my wrath, son. We are going to unleash a full power Kamehameha blast on that fool's face. It will happen. I have foreseen it. Oh, 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 good. I'm still pretty embarrassed that that guy killed me, but you know. It's been roughly six months or so since I've done Skyrim, so I'm a little rusty. Uh, but that dude's damage was pretty freaking massive. Fuck you, Bear Trap. Yes, I know it was in the same exact place last time I came through here, but I forgot. Did you just smack me on the ass? See, I told you guys it does no damage. <laughs> Alright, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna recruit his rat friends. Or not. I just kind of on accident. I meant to do freaking animal allegiance, but whatever. Alright, where are you, you bastard? God damn, that's loud. Really? Alright, while well, you guys fight amongst yourselves. Ah, oh, damn it, he got up. Alright, I have a spell for this. Or I have a shot for this. Oh! <laughs> Good. Man, he's breakdancing on the floor and everything. Stay down, you bitch. Suck on this! Uh, why is he at full health? Since when did that fucking happen? <laughs> uh, paralyzed now! Good. What, what? That's the wrong thing. Okay, well, I guess we got some candlelight going on. Just to whitewash the screen a little bit more. Did I say you can get up? I don't recall saying that. Oh yeah, well. Fuck! God damn it, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. I knew that was gonna happen. Now you fucking die. God fucking damn it! Press the right hotkeys! He's getting up! Ah! The deed is done. You were way more trouble than I expected, Hamelin. Oh, well that might explain a little bit. Give me that. Give me your four coin too. And your journal. Guess what? I'm not even gonna read it. I'm just gonna burn it when I get home. You mad? Oh, wait, you can't be mad, cause you're dead! Whoops! 
I've applied poison to the nest. I pooped all over it. That poison poop. Okay, that's just vile. I apologize. Can I unlock a novice chest on my own without breaking a lockpick? Oh, indeed I can. I'm a little surprised. Six coin? Wow, well, you shouldn't have. No, I mean, really, you shouldn't have. Uh. Okay. Sorry about the freaking uh, candlelight. I know a lot of people complain that it kind of whitewashes the... The, um... The recording. Like, it makes it a little too bright. I didn't mean to cast that. You guys saw I was pressing all the wrong buttons. Uh, are there any other things in here? No, were there any other nests I need to do, or was it just one? Poison hunting brew vat. Oh! Shit, forgot to do that. Alright. Yeah, I figured there's more bear traps around her. And I think we're done. Aside from the vat, of course. I think I gotta do that inside of here. Oh. Uh. Alright. So I got schooled on by the mysterious Rat King dude. I'm still, like, super embarrassed about that. <laughs> but that's shock damage, man. Dude zapped me once and, like, half my health was gone. It's like, oh, what's that? You want health? Nope. You're not allowed. Alright, I got this. I got this by the ass! Firmly grasp it! Firmly grasp it! <sighs> okay, why do I bother? Why do I fucking bother with looting stuff when there's barely any loot in it? Oh. I can see outside. Alright, let's activate the brewer lid. And just poop all in there. <laughs> let's put some cheese in there too. Oh no, the vat closed! Well, I'll just put Pac-Man on top. There we go. Framing Pac-Man for the poop in the vat. Or the boiler, whatever the hell that was called. Give me that brew house key. Oh. So in my channel update video, I mentioned um, my new job that I have. I guess it's not really new anymore. I got hired in October. And, uh, man, do I have some crazy stories from that job. We're getting kind of late into the episode already, but maybe in the next one. This candlelight... Okay, candlelight, you need to go right now. I will stand in the same spot for five hours, so you will go away. Unmoving. Unblinking. Oh, no. No, I did not expect this. This is not what I expected. But guess what? I'm okay with it. Let's do this. We need some more action anyway. Really, he's way over there. And I didn't realize I had Fire Inch knock on that hockey. I meant to conjure Storm Matronox. Because, spoiler alert, this guy appears to be a fire dragon. I'm not sure why I think that. It's just a hunch that I have. Never mind that giant fire plume over there in the distance. Ow! I literally just got roasted. Also, who is that dude who actually conjured Storm Matronox? He did the mage thing better than I did. Here we go. Oh yeah, sit still for this, you bitch. Nope, no magicka for you. No magicka for me either, but you know. <laughs> gotta keep it a fair fight. There we go, that's what I was looking for. Oh, get speared. Get speared. Get dead. I could always use me another dragon soul. <laughs> yes, everything is alright now. Maybe you should ask this guy if everything is alright. He's just walking around while on fire. He's like, no big deal. Some of you might be shocked that I'm on fire, but me? I just call it Tuesday. Give me that loot. Iron Mace of Weariness. You just smack him once and you're like, oh, I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> just gotta lay down right there. 
That would actually be a pretty awesome weapon. Oh yeah, what was? Who was this guy? I never would have believed it. Is Stendar? Oh, really? A Thalmor just this year, or is it just a car? Just this year. Alf what kind of name? Alf <laughs> Alfield. Alfield Battleborn. All right, yeah, I started to mention I got some crazy stories from my job, but we're getting a little late, so I'm not going to share them this time. But I'm thinking future episodes, I might share a story here and there. Also, I do have one thing I want to tell you. There's this song I listen to. I mentioned before that I really like the chill step genre. I really hate the name, but that's what it's called, so I'm stuck with it. And there's a song that I recently discovered. It's called Forgotten Memories, and it's Aries Remix, A-E-R-I-S Remix. Feel free to check it out. It's really good. Um, just look it up on YouTube. And there's this one part of the song that is so awesome. It's at about the three minute mark. There's like just this breath that, that you just hear. And it's so minty fresh. And for some reason, that part is so relaxing. Like when I hear that part of the song, I just imagine a cold, really cold, clear night for some reason. I don't know. It sounds stupid when I'm talking about it now, but if you go and listen to it, you might kind of see what I'm what I mean. Anyway, I guess everyone is staring at me awkwardly. So I let's go ahead and tell this guy. Squirm. <laughs> Why would you say that out loud right in front of him? What is wrong with you? Alright. Was something we discussed Sabuorn unclear? Squirm. The job's finished, you bitch. Well, it's about time. I had to stall the captain until you were finished. What about my pay? You'll just have to wait until after the captain's finished. I oh, hell no. Around if you hell want. no, I don't wait for my coin. A tenth tasting ceremony. This is the most depressing party well, I've ever you <laughs> seen. Now that you've taken care of your little pest problem, how about I get a taste of some of your mead? Help yourself, my lord. It's my finest brew yet. I call it... Hunting brew I can't reserve. wait to see I think you'll find it quite squirm. pleasing to your palate. Oh, come now. This is mead, not some wine to be sipped and savored. Fuck your I shit. Hate. What? What's in this? I... I don't know. What's wrong? You assured me this place was clean. I'll see. See to it that you remain in irons for the rest of your Sounds day. like the captain's about to have some explosive I diarrhea. <laughs> Silence, idiot. I should have known better. He's just gonna shat all over Sabjorn! <laughs> and then Sabjorn will start squirming, I can assure you that, Malice. You sure so don't seem to be in a hurry. Even though someone just attempted to poison you. You, you're coming with me to Dragon's Reach. We'll see how quickly your memory clears in the city's prisons. Now, move. Look, I assure you, this is all just a huge misunderstanding. My is it? Move. Farewell, Sabjorn. I wonder if I could help him towards the door a little bit. I haven't heard even a. <laughs> Someone's being attacked. <laughs> I couldn't resist! I couldn't resist! <laughs> I don't think that could have gone any better. I agree. Anything else you need before you head back to Riften? I need to get a look at Sabjorn's books. So, Maven wants to hunt down Sabjorn's private partner, huh? You're welcome to take a look around Sabjorn's office. He keeps most of his papers stashed in his desk. Here. This should help. Oh, thanks. You never mentioned the crazy rat king, by the way. I thought it would be better to leave some of the details out of our previous discussion. Didn't want to risk you walking away from the job. Besides, you well, done Maven a favor getting rid of Had I known he was that saved me from unbelievably strong, I might have walked away from the job. Later. The dude too shot the Grand Archmage's Pimpus himself. What are you gonna do with Start the place? Start changing it over to the Blackbriar Meadery West as soon as possible. That was Maven's part of the deal. 
She's put me in charge of keeping the mead flowing, so that's exactly what I'm gonna do. If you're in the area, and you ever need anything fenced, you just let me know. Hey, thanks. Remember to put in a good word with Maven for me. Um, no. Alright, so this might be the part where I find the ledger. I don't think I even found the ledger in here, did I? I swear there was one here. Well, I guess I was wrong. No, no, you know what? I still stand by it. Even though I can't find it, I know there's one here. I know it. It's I can picture it in my mind. It's on the table. Or a table. And table. Oh, well. If anyone knows where it is, feel free to leave a comment down below. But I am I'm starting to go crazy because of it. I don't see any other rooms or anything. Oh well, let's get the hell out of here. Excellent. Also, let's read that promissory note. Sabjorn, within the enclosed crate you'll find the final payment. As we discussed, Hunting Brew Meadery should now begin brewing mead at full production. In regards to your concerns about interference from Maven Blackbriar, I can assure you that I'll do everything in my power to keep her assets and her cronies at bay. This is the beginning of a long and successful future for both of us. Uh, what? Oh, okay, that's the Sabjorn. For some reason I thought that was to, um, dude bro who's inside the meadery right now. And I was like, wait, didn't he want me to give Maven Blackbriar his regards? Freaking Malice Lannister. But yeah, but now I remember that that was to Sabjorn and that was his partner in the mead business. She wants to know who that is so she can dunk all over her, I guess. Anyway, we're a little bit over 30 minutes now. By the way, that song I mentioned earlier, um, Forgotten Memories, I'll go ahead and put a link to that in the description if you want to listen to it. You can just hop on down there, give it a little click, and see what you think. If you listen to it and you kind of like it, feel free to leave a comment back on here letting me know that you did that. And I'm going to go ahead and end it here. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And there is going to be more Skyrim videos soon to come. And I'm sure you don't believe me because every time I say that, I go on another break. But <laughs> I guess I'll just have to prove it to you. So I will see you all in the next one for some more. Whoa. Oh, no. 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 He's trying to arrest me. Help. Help. All I did was push Sabjorn. He was a criminal. He tried to poison the captain of your guard, by the way. Did you know that? He didn't know that. He doesn't know. They don't know either. Nobody knows. Uh, 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 go away. Go away. You have no idea who you're messing with. Stop. Stop. Okay, fine. You have committed crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? I say... I said, well, my bounty is 40 and I got to pay this dude over 600 to leave me alone? Whatever. Everything here appears to be in order. <laughs> move along now. Yes. Everything is good. I totally didn't assault Sabjorn. Nobody saw anything. How much coin do I have anyway? Oh. I, I officially have so much coin that I don't give a fuck what I spend it on. <laughs> That's a good feeling, by the way. I wish I had that feeling in real life, you know, but... Oh, well. One can dream, right? Anyway, I'm now I'm going to end it. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you all in the next one for some more Skyrim Thieves Guild action. Take care, everybody. Bye.